this is a um, really quick way of uh, approaching this EGR unit especially to taking off the EGR valve basically so loosen this bolt okay when you lose this bolt so you can move this thing around even take this bolt out using 12 millimeter All right once you take this bolt out this guy moves so freely so <clears throat> these are eight millimeter metric eight probably metric 10 eight millimeter uh my i use that sort of socket okay so eight millimeter i got them from autozone because the previous um screws were so horrible i wasn't able to um, loosen them just by using a, a flip screwdriver and then i just what i did was just cut them and put those things new it's really easy for me to make sure that if my valve is um, seized or not to just um, loosen them and then make sure the valve is uh, uh, running uh, functionally so uh, or functioning properly so yeah there we go so loosen this bolt and then reach the valve so what I have done right now to make sure that my continuity test is running I just came here so I'm just going to show you guys the, the number that I read really quickly so about the camera because I'm trying to record it by myself alone <laughs> so there we go so that's the number I see okay which means that it is actually running like this like this yep so my continuity test is successful and then so what am i going to do right now when i have a time i will clean the valve so that's pretty much it so now it's valve is uh, running properly but it is better to clean time to time so that we won't see any anything in the uh, intake manifold because uh, the very common uh, problem i used to see in the intake manifold is oil so that was the things it could be also related to uh, pvc valve that is uh, just underneath all this intake manifold as well if the pvc valve is uh, stuffed and clogged and uh, or even open at all times that leads to uh, the the oil comes into intake manifold in addition to this egr valve so there we go guys i hope this video will get you help if you have any question please uh, leave your question uh, down below thank you for watching